nothing, just sitting here looking at all these bills that I have no idea how me and Jack will pay. <sighs> well, <laughs> you better hurry up and figure something out or I'll be leaving his butt. <laughs> I'm serious, girl. Ain't nobody scared of him. <laughs> You're so silly. Day. That was a long I know, right? There goes my baby. Girl, I know. Girl, look. Bye. Hey, baby. I'm home. What's going on? Hey, Jackson. What What are you doing? Oh, just sitting here thinking. That's all. Baby, do you realize in 18, 22, 23, 24, do 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 in less than 24 hours, girl, we'll be celebrating our first full year of marriage. Mm-hmm. It's been one long year. I mean, what's the matter? You're not happy? Look, you, you killing my vibe here. Look at my face, Jackson. Don't I look happy? If that's happy, I really hate to see you sad. Whatever, Jackson. <laughs> hey, what did you cook? You know, I'm starving. It's been a long day. I cooked the same thing that I made. Today, baby. Hey, that's my baby. You know the way to a man hurts is through his stomach. Mm-hmm, sure isn't. Wait, you didn't cook nothing yesterday. Congratulations, Jackson. You are smarter than a fifth grader. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Listen, I think it's something you really want to talk about. If that's the case, then let's talk about it. Look, have you talked to your dad about taking over the family business because these past two notices are not going to pay baby, themselves? Baby, baby, listen, listen, listen. Serious? That's where we at right now? Look, you know my dream is to finish school, become a successful lawyer, run my own law firm like Johnny Cockridge. First of all, it's Johnny Cochran. Co- Cochran? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, and this is a <laughs> real long dream because movies don't even last this long, baby. Oh, my God. Look, listen. You know that I finish school real soon and I'll be able to take the bar exam. Well, guess what, baby? Huh? These bills? You see? You see uh-huh. Yeah, those. those they gonna send me to the bar. Look, first of all... You want your wife to be alcoholic? No, what? Look, it's not gonna always be like this. You, you got faith in me, right? Jackson. Yes. You know I love you, right? Oh, baby, I know you love me, girl. Wait, wait, wait. What about Courtney? <laughs> yeah, I heard too. Listen, you know what to do me so much justice if you spend more time with her. I don't know, Jackson. I... I don't think she likes me very much. It's not that. She's been going through a long, you know, just this hard period in life. She lost her mother at such a young age. No, I'm I'm pretty sure she don't like me. And that mouth of hers? Oh, Jackson, you need to do something about that. Hey, 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 hey. Just spend time with her. That's all I ask. I don't know. Maybe maybe I took on too much. Maybe this is just too much for me. Too, Too much? Yeah. For you? Yeah. Already? It's only been a year. You know what, baby? Just drop it, okay? Oh, that's right. I'm going to call Robin and we going to go hang out, get some girl time in, you know. Hey, I'm going to run and check on Courtney, yeah, okay? Yeah, you go ahead, all right. Why don't you tell yeah, Robin I'm saying? I'm going to you, baby. Mm-hmm, yes. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> hey, babe. <laughs> Same place? All right. I see you in a minute. This feels thick. I know they piling up. Hey, Dad. Hey, Courtney. Hey, baby. Where's Miss Lynn? You know, she went to go spend time with Robin. On a weeknight? Baby, she's not a little kid. She can go spend time with her friends on a weekday, baby. You know, I would like you to start calling her something other than her name. Trust me, there's a few names I can think of other than her name. Baby, baby, listen. <laughs> How about calling her mom? I'm not calling her mom. She doesn't even like me, and I don't even like her. Courtney, I really wish you two could really get along. Why should I have to be the one that tries? She's the adult. I know. She's really been stressing about all these bills, and she don't realize that you need her right now. I don't need her. And speaking of mom, I've been having those dreams again. I'm sorry, baby. How did that make you feel? It makes me feel sad every time I dream of her. I don't know why God would allow me to grow up without a mother. You know... I really wish I had the answer for you. Every time I dream of her, she's always just laying there at the edge of my bed just staring at me. That's amazing. You can 
visualized images from just pictures? I would have done anything to have been able to spend time with her. It's just not fair that God took her away from us. No, you cannot blame God. Most of all, you cannot blame yourself. <laughs> You've grown to be such a beautiful young lady. I know your mom's looking down like, wow. She's very proud of you, because I know that I am. Thanks, Dad. No problem. What time is She's taking so long. I'm going to go check on her, see, check on Lynn, see what's taking her so long, okay? Okay. All right, don't. I'm watching TV. Okay. God, I don't want to be angry about not having my mom around. And I'm really glad. I'm, I'm really glad that you gave me such a great father, but I, I just don't understand why you gave me no time with her. All my friends have moms, but I don't. Why did it have to be me? He was gonna get out tonight. I told you I'd get out. You think <laughs> he saw me come out here with you? Nah, he ain't got no clue. Good. 
How's that old wife of yours? <laughs> Look, she's not here. You are. That's all that matters. Hmm. Well, we need to let them know that we're going to be together. <laughs> oh, we will. Just give it a little time. Well, don't make me wait too long. A girl has needs, you know. <laughs> oh, I know you do, baby. But uh, let me go on and get up out of here. I think that nosy neighbor of yours is acting like she's sweeping. Of course she is. Hey, you. Are you talking to me? Tiptoe through the tulips. Do you see anybody else around here besides me and the spirit of Jezebel? <laughs> here you go, sweeping that same spot. Mm. Just being nosy, just like you always do. It ain't that much dirt in the world. <laughs> you think? <laughs> Honey, if it wasn't people for people like you supporting the nosy go find me, I couldn't be nosy. You give me something to be nosy about. But I thank you for making lifetime real for me, sweet. You know what? Your mind is playing tricks on you. Did she say tricks? Honey, you can stop, drop, or roll. Either way, in front of the mirror. This is the only trick that I see. Remember, the tricks come out at night. Boom, boom. Yeah, I got your trick. <laughs> Back up off me, baby. Mm. And that married man that you just left mm. has your treats. Mm. And I don't think you need to worry about what it is that I do. Listen, 12 o'clock. Huh. I'm not worried about what you're doing, but I think you need to worry about how it's going to turn out for you. You need to mind your own business. That's what you need to do. Have a great night. Yeah, okay. Keep thinking you the hot biscuit this side of Texas. Okay? You better call on her man. She better learn some scriptures. When you sweep, you reap. I know the scripture. Oh yeah, I know the scripture. <laughs> okay, so if I'm Peter, a hey, Paul, do you know where my dad is? He should be home soon, Courtney. Well, since there's no one else here, could you help me with my homework? Don't you see that I'm busy right now? Just as I assumed. You're always too busy to help me. Little girl, you better watch the way you talk to me. My dad always helps me with my homework. And when your daddy gets home, he can help you with your homework. <laughs> Go to your room while I take this call. Whatever. <sighs> hey. Yeah, I'm here with this little brat right now. <laughs> Her father should be home real soon. <laughs> All right, I'll see you in a bit. Love you. Bye. Was that my dad? Little girl, didn't I tell you to go in your room? What am I going to do with you? Hmm, let's think about that. Nothing like you always do. You know what? The only thing that's missing with your little smart mouth is your neck. That do was it. such a long ride. Hey, I'm glad you two are getting along. I was my favorite two girls in the whole world. I'm good, Dad. Of course you are. Yeah. Okay. Whatever. Lynn, hey baby, that includes you too. I had a long I day. I miss you. Did you miss me? <laughs> hey, at least one of my girls did. <laughs> of course. You know, I, I don't know what's her problem. But we gonna have to. Hey, so what do you do today? Nothing. 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 Ain't nothing cooked. Nope. Ain't nothing clean. Nope. You you was busy? Excuse me? <laughs> Excuse me? Turn this TV off. I was busy. Is that okay with you, your majesty? Busy doing what? You don't work? Don't worry about what I do. Ooh. Ooh. Glory be. <laughs> <laughs> Baby girl. <laughs> Could you excuse the dots right quick? I've been told her to go tell yeah. her. I don't even know why she's down here. Yeah, but you better get her. Whatever. Little hey. smart, that little smart mouth. Hey, would you like to tell me what kept you so busy you couldn't clean or cook around here? No, not really. Hmm. <sighs> you, you know what? Do, you want a divorce? Is, would that solve everything you're going through? A divorce? A di I don't know, Jackson. I, I need time to think about this. You, you need time to think. I'm, you're just bringing it up. About what we need to do. Well, apparently I need time. You know what? Take all the time you want. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go to bed. 
Because mm -hmm. I got to work tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Unlike you, somebody has to pay these bills around here. Uh, yeah, not really paying the bills, but you go ahead and have a good night. <laughs> <sighs> busy, busy, busy. You go through so much, you just got to get to the church house. Reverend Smith. Is he, is he available? Jackson who? Jackson, that's your last name. Mr. Jackson, what's your first name? First name Jackson. Mm -hmm. Last name Thomas. Your first name is Jackson? I ain't never heard that. Like, no Brian's was available, no DeAndre's. I'm just trying to understand. Watch Jackson is your last name? Make me lose my religion. Listen, my name is Jackson Thomas. Oh. Mr. Jackson, if you nasty. Ma'am. Wait a minute. <laughs> you, you hit me with the ma'am? Ma'am, you look all oh, oh. thicky. The way your mouth runs. Actually, I'm young enough to be your daughter. Yeah, time to tell about that. What can I help you with? Let, I just said I'm here to see the Reverend. Is he is? he in? Oh, Is he available? Do you have an appointment? No, I do not have an appointment. Oh. He, told me, he, he told me if ever I need to see him, I can come right down to the church. Well, protocol? You need an appointment. My, my name ain't protocol. That's something new. Can you, look, can you get up and go get the pastor for me? I'd appreciate it. You know what? Hold your horses. I, I don't have no horses. I'll get the pastor. I appreciate it. It's, I'm like, this church is this. <laughs> Nasty little secretary on the road. He's making who's my religion. Ah, Jackson. Pastor, how we doing? How you doing there, bro? Oh, man, thank you for seeing me, man. Oh, anytime for one of my favorite parishioners. Oh, how's Lynn? Hey. Lynn, that's what I come and talk to you about, Lynn. Man, we hear the rough patch in our marriage. How so? Oh, man, I don't, man, I don't know how to start this off, Pastor, man. I really don't. Start from the beginning. I mean, take all the time you need. All the time? All the time. That's what I'm talking about. We see always complaining about a, a bigger house, a, a nicer car, about the bills. She just complains all the time. <laughs> Is that all? Man to man. Whew. I ain't getting none, Pastor. <laughs> You're not getting no what, Jackson? You're not getting what? I ain't getting no sex, man. <laughs> That's because a real man doing so. Um, so I'm like, you got a real problem there, son. Um, are you sure you're doing everything in your power to make your marriage work? I mean, yeah, everything like what? Well, your vows say for rich or for poor. Are you following through with that? Yeah, I'm doing that. I mean, but shouldn't it be something more than that? Well, Jackson, there's a saying. Mm -hmm. No romance. Romance. Without <laughs> finance. Uh-oh, that's the church money? No, 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 but the Lord's been good to me. Very good to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's been a good year. It's been a good year. I, I see. But as I was saying, have you at least prayed about it? Pastor, I pray so much. I need some new knee pads. Hmm. Well, Jackson, maybe the two of you shouldn't be married in the first place. I mean, maybe not divorce is an option. Man, listen. Per this Bible, divorce is not an option. Yeah, but uh, Lynn is a very... Yeah, that's my baby. Very, very. Hold on, wait a minute. No, no disrespect. I mean, no that's disrespect. when they disrespect. Listen, 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 listen. No disrespect. But again, Lynn is a very beautiful woman. Man, you need to. Are you sure times. you want to make her stand in marriage she doesn't want to be in? Man, are you serious? I come for you for help, and all you tell me is a divorce? Look, look, look. <laughs> I'm just stating the facts. Like I said, you cannot make a woman stand in marriage she don't want to be in. Also, make this point clear to you as well. <laughs> But look, 
<laughs> oh, don't, 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 don't cut me off, brother. I was, I was making my point again. Man, you got a snotty, very beautiful woman, but uh, <laughs> wait, you got a snotty receptionist, and then you got the audacity to tell. Hold me on, hold on a second. You know what? Did he just put me on hold? <laughs> hey, hey. No, no, no. He gave me hey, the baby. finger though. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you soon. Mm-hmm. Yep. Talk to you soon. Bye. Hey, that's awesome. That's your wife? Man, I wish my wife would call and check on me at work sometime. <laughs> she calling somebody. What? Oh, uh, listen. <laughs> like I said, something came up. Ouch. I, mean, I, 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 know, I know what I said. I know what I said. But listen, I got another appointment to get to. I'm praying for the both of you. you praying I, yes, I'm praying for the both of you, son. Believe me, I am. Secretary Green to see you out. I'll see you shortly. You just. Hey, you man. Just hey, 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 hey. Get up out of here, man. See, this is what happens when you don't have an appointment. You're going to push me out the. the <clears throat> Reverend Green. Yes. You're just busy today. There's somebody else out here. Should I bring her in? Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Um, Sister Green. Yes. Uh, you dropped something. Where? About uh, right there. Right here? Uh-huh. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, Lord. Wait a minute. Oh, I see it. I don't see it. I see it. <laughs> Reverend oh, I Green. See it. Yeah? You a mess. Oh, I know, baby. I know. <laughs> oh, Lord, have mercy. Hey, sexy. How are you? <laughs> All right, you just missed that old lame husband of yours coming in here trying to get counseling for you. Are you serious? Wait, he didn't see that was me calling, did he? Nah, he thought it was my wife. He thought of what? He thought it was my wife. Mm, and how is that old wife of yours anyhow? Look, 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 don't even go into that. That's not important. Mm. You here right now. Mm. So what's up? So, did you tell him that you're sexting me? <laughs> no, but I told him you deserve the best. And who's going to give me the best, then? <laughs> I'm going to give it to you, of course. <sighs> well, don't make me wait too long. Mm, I won't, baby, but uh, you need to get up out of here because my secretary is snooping around, but uh, <laughs> I'm going to see you tonight. You sure will. Oh, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Mm, 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 mm. Watch TV, huh? Yeah. Somebody always go. Uh oh. Ah! There goes my mother, and there goes my father. How y'all doing? Hey, baby. What's going on? We all right. All right, mama. Yeah. You know you have a seat there. How you doing, Hello, Dad? Son. How's it going? I'm pretty good. How you doing? I'm doing good. You know I called you, you guys over. It's okay if I talk to you guys for a second. What's wrong, son? Everything's wrong. My bills are piling up. Lynn and, Cor Lynn and Cordy just can't get along to save their lives. And my marriage is crumbling. It's everything. Well, baby, you know we're your parents. And we're here to help you. You know that, right? Yes, ma'am. I mean, but I can't have you guys paying all my bills. Well, hold on, son. Look, son. There's nothing wrong with asking for help from time to time. Don't let your pride get in the way of asking for help. Yes, sir. We worked hard for all our family, just like you're working hard for your family. You know what, son? Your father's right. So just let us know how we can help. Hmm. I would like to talk about the family business. Wait a minute. Um, hold it. Hold it. What do you mean the family oh. business? I was, I was just wondering, was the option still on the table to well, take son, over the family business? Son, it was never off the table. Okay. In fact, ever since you saw Johnny Cochran get yeah. O.J. <laughs> he off on that murder charge, you said you wanted to be a lawyer. What's yes, changed? Lynn, it's marriage. She complains about everything. <laughs> Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. No way. You know, even to the point, I even think she's having an affair. No way. I know you ain't gonna quit school. Yeah, but listen, son. You sure she's having an affair? Yeah, I'm sure. Well, I... let me tell you this. You gotta work real hard to stay in your marriage. But if she's having an affair, there's something going on. I mean, something's not right. I, that's what I, I mean, I feel that. So what do I do? How do I fix this? Mm. 
Son, don't give up on your dreams for no one. Mm. You, you know what, baby? Mm. Counseling. Have you tried counseling? Counseling. <laughs> you know, I talked to her about counseling. She go see the pastor more than I do. Oh. But it don't seem like it's working. I mean, every time I talk to her about it, she tells me no. 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 <laughs> Okay, baby. You know what? You. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait a minute, baby. I got this. This right here? Yes, ma'am. This is all the counseling that you need, baby. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. That's something to stand on. Yes, it is, baby. Yes, it is. Son, you may not want to hear this, but. But what? What is my hurt? Oh. Okay. The reason she's not. Trying to stay in your marriages because she might have somebody else. Ooh, man. That's a deal breaker. I, I can't believe that. You know what it is, Mom? What is it, baby? She's stressing about these bills right now. You know, I think that's really what... I cannot believe, Dad, that she will go behind my back and cheat on me. I can't believe that. You know your father say a whole lot, but... You can't tell that boy that. <sighs> well, you know it's true. She don't like this boy. No, listen. What? Listen. 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 Listen, baby, go and talk to your wife, okay? Yes, ma'am. Find out what the problem is. And when you find out what the problem is, fix it. Thank you. Uh, you know what? Thank you for your advice. Oh, baby. Dad, we gonna pray for him. You know, love you. We all need to pray Bring for him. Bring it on. <laughs> love you, love you. Oh, I appreciate your advice. No problem, baby. Come on here now. Yes, ma'am. Come on. You I'm, told that boy I, some I, mess I, like I that. I had to tell him like it is. Uh, Get he, on out of here. He speaks his mind, don't he? You know, God, it's a lot of trying times I've been going through. I'm quite sure you see it. I'm quite sure you know of it. But I come to you like I always do. I'm your son. You're my father. And I thank you for the beginning of everything that you've ever done for me. I thank you for what's going on right now. I even thank you about what you're going to do. So I bring my marriage to you because I know if nobody else you will make this work. I can stand on your word. <laughs> I bring my bills to you. I bring everything to you, Heavenly Father. They say if you bring it to the throne and you leave it, it will be taken care of. And I trust that. I believe that. I love you. If no one else ever believed in you, I do. If no one else ever loved you, I do. I know trying times will come, but I look forward to them. Because I know you would take care of me. Love you. So much. <sighs> Even when there's nothing else to believe in. God is able. I believe in you. God is able. God is able.
about the new car that my new man just bought me. Okay, and which man would that be this week? <laughs> the one that bought this, okay? Okay, yes. all right. Now, what kind of car is it? Oh. I want to see. You going to take me for a test drive? You know, I don't know. I think it's like a Mercedes S-Class, something like that. I don't know, girl. Robin, baby, you got a new car and you don't even know what it is. Girl, the only thing that matters is that it's nice. And I'm not paying for it, okay? <laughs> yes, thank you. That's all good. Oh, girl, I remember those days, but... Mm -hmm. Man, Jackson, can't afford to give me a new car right now. Oh. We can barely keep the lights on around here. Is he close to finishing law school? Girl, I'm tired of close. He's been close. <laughs> and for dealing with that daughter of his, girl, Jackson owes me a car and a big old pretty house. Owes you? <laughs> the last time I checked, Jackson was your husband, not your daddy. I know, but ain't it his responsibility to give me everything that I want and need? Hold on. Jackson is a good man now. I know he's just going through some things right now. In a minute, he's going to make sure that you have everything that you want and need. Flex. Oh, well, he might want to hurt me. I'm going to get it from my sponsor. Hold on, wait. I know you're not saying what I think you're saying. Oh, I'm saying exactly what you think I'm saying. Okay. Mm -mm. What is wrong with you, Lynn? You are a married woman. Look, it was somebody I confided in, okay? Kind of just happened. How did it just happen? Because I went to him for counseling and, you know. Uh-uh, I'm worried about you, Lynn. <sighs> Look, trust me. I know what I'm doing. I'm sure. Besides, he has everything. He does. Oh, he's powerful. Okay. He's smart. Oh, girl, his money is real long. <laughs> and not to mention, he is fun. Hell is where you're going if you go through with this. Lynn, what is your problem? You mean to tell me you're willing to give up your entire marriage for a 60-second fling? <laughs> Trust me, boo, it's not 60 seconds. <laughs> oh, and he's definitely not a fling. He's just everything that Jackson isn't. <sighs> Hold on. Haven't you ever heard that saying? That you never, ever leave your 80 for your 20? Girl, let me tell you, the grass is not always greener. Trust me. You know what you Robin, ain't this the in the kettle black? Cause last I checked, one of just a couple years ago you was dating that married ball player. <laughs> yes. Yeah. So I wasn't married. I wasn't the one breaking no covenant. Oh yeah, that makes all the difference, right? It does. Oh, okay, come on, seriously. Lynn, you've only been married for what, a year? Have you tried counseling? Wanna see your past? More than you know. <sighs> Give me like that, Robin. Look you like what? Like I'm about to ask you if you creeping with the preacher? Well, I mean, it just happened, okay? No, it didn't just happen, okay? Look, Robin. No, I'm Robin. Lynn. <laughs> yes, you Robin. You all messed up in the head with this mess. Look, yes, Robin. You are my best friend, and I love you. But girl, you better fix this. Before it fixes you. I gotta go. Robin! Okay. You're my best you. friend. You can't. Be crazy, girl. Goodbye. Oh my gosh. Drama after drama after drama. Mess with this man. Uh, excuse you, yes. I hope you told your adulterated friend about herself. <laughs> excuse me, who you talking to, old lady? Oh, lady. Excuse you. You know exactly who I'm talking to and what I'm talking about. Not too long ago, skipping down Repentance Street, running up to Salvation House, she has well, You know that old man, man that's coming by here is up to no good. Be quiet. Oh, it's in somebody else's business. What's wrong with old people? Listen, I got to get out of here. Listen, 12 o'clock, too. Okay? I'm mad in my own business. And the woman's at the whales, too. That's the problem. I gotta go. I gotta hold go. up. Hold up. Tweety. Okay. Okay. I understand. I understand your concern about your friend. I'm sorry. I'm a concerned neighbor, too, because I see this all the time. But just tell her something for me to make it better. What? What do you want? 
who's making love to your old man. I love scriptures. <laughs> hey, baby. <laughs> I was wondering when you were going to get here. For no need to wait no longer, baby. What's happening? <sighs> Nothing. Just waiting for you. <laughs> so, uh... What time that boy left today? <laughs> he was supposed to leave at 8, but he left at 9.30. Hmm. Weird, right? You think he got a plan? You think you know you about to leave him? <laughs> I doubt it. All he's talking about is counseling this. Counseling that. He's so tired of that stupid forklift job and the paint shop and night school and whatever it is he does. <laughs> Trust me, he's completely oblivious. Look, don't underestimate that man now. You really got to be comfortable with having me come around here. But uh, we are going to be together soon. Well, you know what? What are you saying? You don't want me anymore? Of course I want you, baby. But like I said, we both got some situations to take care of first. You know what? I understand, okay? And I'm willing to be patient. Look, look, look. Enough with all that talking. Let's get in the back and do what we came to do and get this party started. Okay. <laughs> Come on, baby. About to give you this sexual healing. <laughs> Man, Trace. Woo. Man, Trace, bro, the A. Dude, that was a good day, man. And hey, you know what? I left work early. Lynn always talking about she going to the gym. I'm going down there to make sure she at that gym today. Man, I am trying not to go to the gym. I'm going to go back to work. You want me to go to the gym with you, dog? Man, no, man, I got this. Don't even worry about it. Mm -hmm. I'm looking for my... What's the name? What's up? Who keys are these? Well, you see some keys? Them Lynn keys, man. Oh, we got to hear from get out of here, man. I think she here. I don't want her to know I'm trying to spy on her, man. Let's get out of here. Man, you scared? Man, it's your house, man. I you, listen to T.I. I mean, I ain't never scared. <laughs> <laughs> but we, we do need to hurry up, though, I ain't. But you already know. What's up? I'm hungry. I gotta give me a sandwich, dog. Are you serious? Can I make a sandwich real quick? Right Damn now. It. You ain't gotta be that scared. Bro, man, fit flow. Get the sandwich. Let's get out of here. Jack, hold on, man. Hey, you got any juice to go with the sandwich? This guy is impossible. Dude, no parch. Get the juice. What? No, no thirsty. No get the juice, dude. Oh, but all you got is these Dixie cups? This guy's impossible right here, man. I'm trying to get out of here. Get the juice. Get your sandwich. And let's go, right, man. man. Here I come, Jack. Look, God, this dude is crazy. Let's go together. So. <sighs> Baby, I'm about to get some spoons and some ice cream so we can make some Sunday. Lynn! You start is not what you think. It's not what you think. Wait, man, you're in my house. You got my mom. This is my good son. Look, man. Look, 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 look. I can explain. I can explain. Can you explain to your wife. Oh, 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 oh. Whoa. Hey. Hey. This man in my house. Hey. Are you serious? I'm sorry. I didn't think we needed to stop it. I'm sorry. Oh, my man. If look, I, look, man, look, look. I'm talking about this like man. Leave him alone. We can't talk. You, you deserve each other. Oh, no.
know what? <laughs> Since the cat's out of the bag. The cat's out the bag. I may as well be honest with you. Be honest? <laughs> We're gonna be together. Together? <laughs> together. Are you that stupid? He told me, and I believe him. You know what? You got to be dumb as hell if you think that man is going to leave his wife for the likes of you. And what the hell does that mean? No man leave his wife for his mistress or his jump off, whatever you let that man call you. You know what's funny? I'm like you, Jackson. <laughs> he knows that I'm a 100% woman. And I deserve all the finer things in life. Now how's that for your mistress? Are you serious? Or jump off, Jackson. Serious? This is about the finer things in life? Lordy, you can provide for me with this low-paying job that you have? A wife and a daughter, and you a forklift driver? How embarrassing! You should be ashamed. Woman, hmm. I work hard every day. Put a roof over your head, food in that fridge, and gas in your car. Did you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. You call that thing out here a car? Oh. <laughs> Your little friend promised you a car, huh? He sure did. <laughs> you got the be Let's get this right. Mm -hmm. Your little toe-sucking mm -hmm. preacher boyfriend yes. said he going said he going to leave his wife. Check. <laughs> he going to buy you a car. Oh, my favorite check. And a big beautiful house, huh? Yes, I'm happy. <laughs> and everything yo Little heart desire. Sure did. So you can call me dumb or stupid or whatever you will, but Jackson, my mind is already made up. You know what? You ain't dumb. <laughs> and you ain't stupid. That, right, I'm going to call me. it like I see it. You shallow. <laughs> you so shallow, you will leave your marriage for a married man? Jackson, you know what? <laughs> Jackson, you know what? You might want to watch your tongue. <laughs> Look, boo-boo. I ain't even trying to change your mind. You did that for the both of us. Mm. Jackson, baby, you might not want to think. You know, that never has been your strong suit. But since you mentioned divorce earlier, I'm going to need you to go get them papers because I'm going to need one of those as soon as possible. You Matter of fact, make that stacked. <laughs> yeah, go on, grab them. What are you doing? Where do you think you're going this late? Oh, I ain't going nowhere. You better not. You got the audacity to check me about what you just got caught doing? Big woman, this is my house. I'm gonna hurt this my house. I'll pay the bills in this house. <laughs> Barely. I pay the bills in this house. You think you're gonna run around with your little boyfriend, lay all up in here until you decide to leave me? Dang, what's happening? Lynn, get your stuff. Get out of my house. Cause I don't want you no more. Jackson, I don't have nowhere else to go! You know what? That's not my problem. That's your little preacher boy buying you everything problem. You know what? Mm. You can have all of this junk. You just better believe I'll be well taken care of with him. <laughs> Bye, Felicia. Oh. Wait. 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 You serious? <laughs> Wait. This is not happening, right? Baby. I'm sorry. Yeah. Really? Baby. If I could, could forget him, I would. Please believe me. And I know that I should throw the town in. Maybe it's not, not that easy. Hey, you treat me so much better than him. And if I was saying there'd be no competition, but, but I love. Someone else. I'm so sorry. Hey, hey. I'm in love with another man, and I know it ain't right. Jackson, baby, look. 
you should go and find someone else to treat you right, give you the world. Someone who understands the man you are, cause baby, you shine so bright, and now it's just in your I'm in love with a man And I'm so sorry You know God, you, you know God, this is, this is so funny. It's so funny, I'm upset with you right now. How, I mean, I came to you for prayer to make this work, and this is what you do to me? It's like you smile in my face. I give you everything, everything I came to you. Did you allow this to happen? I gave you my marriage. I mean, you took Courtney mom from us? You took my marriage from me? How can I even stomach to pray to you anymore? Everybody gives to you. You're supposed to be such a giver, but I never see you give back. You know, the preacher even warned me. He warned me. My parents were warned me. My daughter don't even like me.
gonna get him, and I'm gonna get you some water, because you look thirsty. taking land mom from me. Thanks for taking this marriage away from me. Thanks for nothing. Hey, Dad. Hey, Courtney. <clears throat> How was school, baby? It was good. Are you crying? No, I am not crying. Well, it looks like tears to me. Well, there are allergies. You don't even have allergies. I got allergies now. Well, excuse me. I don't know why you said about Miss Lynn anything. 
anyway, I'm glad that she's gone. Not sad. You're 13. What do you know? I understand more than what you give me credit for. I know that she didn't love you for you, and I know that you're a good man and a good father, and that any woman would be glad to have you as a husband. I, you know, I needed to hear that. Thank you, baby. Thank you so much. Whew, you know, that was really good. Maybe I should take advice from you more often. That'd be a good idea. That'd be a good idea. <laughs> I got an even better idea. Mm -hmm. Watch this. Why don't... You know what we do. Why don't you go start your homework? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Miss good advice. Oh, I got an even better one. Put your, right, here we go. Watch this. Right there. Me and you. And I start dinner. Sounds good? I guess. Awesome. Love you. Be to check on you in a second. Okay. Love you too. Oh. A man get a break around here? Everybody come around. If <sighs> son, yeah. what's, what's the matter, son? What's going on? It's Lynn. She's having an affair. She what? Yeah. I am positive. Oh. How do you know this? I caught her red-handed. That burns me up. How can she do this to my son? You know what? Makes matters even worse. It gets worse than that. How can it get any worse than an affair? <laughs> the person she was cheating with. What? Hmm. You mean to tell me you know the punk has been sleeping with your wife? <laughs> you know what? Brace yourself. It was that same low down, dirty preacher that married us. Ooh. See what, I, what I've been telling you all along? See what I've been telling you? I told you them preachers ain't no good. All they want to do is to steal the money and chase them no good women around the church. Now, James, you know that ain't true. I've seen this on many occasions, and now it's happening to my son. That's why I stopped going to church a long time ago. That's why you stopped going. You know. That's not a bad idea. As long as I am Jackson, Jackson Thomas, I will never step foot into another there church again. Son. There you go, son. That's just the whole block. I don't blame you. Me and you. Not That's I've right. I've been on my knees go. praying and fasting right. for you all these years. You don't say something like that, you baby. That devil in my life. I just want to know why you behind me. <laughs> <laughs> You're a young man, you can take that. Huh. Look, Mom. What? I love you. And I appreciate everything you've done for me. But from here on out, I can't do your God anymore. So I can't. Because if, if God loved me so much, why would he allow this to happen? Can you explain that to me? Yeah, explain it to him. Explain it, tell him. Watch it, you gotta go home with me. Hey, Listen, sick. baby, you know what? I can't explain it, but I do know that God allows us to make our own choices. Lynn made the choice to cheat. God had nothing to do with that. She's a tramp, and that man needs a good behind. If you don't sit down, yes. you gonna get a good beat. Yes, baby. words that can ease that pain that you're going through. As your mother, I wish I could take all that pain onto myself. But baby, please, you can't turn your back on God. I spent too much time raising you, and I didn't raise you like that. Mom, 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 mom. <laughs> I love you. I, I can say that time and time again, but <laughs> me and your God will never have a relationship again. Jesus, uh-uh. No, 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 let him go. Let him go and be a man. You know what? Uh -oh. When we get home, you're going to drop on your I'm knees and play with me for that I'm boy. I'm going to. 
When the saints come marching in, when the saints come march, when the sin come marching in, when the sin come. All right, Lynn, come on. Why you got me out here outside? What do you want to talk about? To tell you what happened. You won't believe what this man did to me. What, what man? Jackson? <laughs> Smith. Mm-hmm. Oh, let me guess. Yeah. He told you he was gonna leave his wife. You know yeah. he did. Mm-hmm. And then, well then, and then, and then, and then what? what? And then he said he wasn't leaving her. Man, well, I you thought you. This is what was gonna happen. Yes. Do that. I told her that's what happened. He told me that he loved that me. Girl, that man ain't love you. No, he didn't. He loved what you was giving to him. He just and ain't that into you. Wanted him. Girl, to tell you the truth. That ain't love, and you didn't love him either. But I did, mm-hmm. Robin Broly. I, I was falling for him. No, you was not falling he for wasn't him, bro. You falling for you. You just love the idea, the thought mm-hmm. of him. You love he could provide you all those things that you said Jackson couldn't. Girl, mm-hmm. that ain't love either. Not a- so what am I supposed to do? I treated Jackson terrible. Uh, go get your do. man back. What man? <laughs> do you think that Jackson will forgive me? No. Some support. Maybe. Maybe not. But what you do need to do is go and talk to him. Try to fix your marriage. Ask him which one. Oh my goodness, old lady, be quiet. Look, Lynn, you gotta go talk to your husband. You gotta get yourself out of this. Go talk to him, pray with him, do something. I said I'm gonna pray. Ignore her. Like that. Ignore her. Huh? So anyway. Thanks, Robin. Come on. I know. Come well, on, bring it in. You just going to mm-hmm. mess. Just go. ignore we gotta go. me, Come okay? On. Oh, my goodness, lady. Just, you always sit in my business. Come on. <laughs> See, the problem with these young women today, they want new things with old benefits. <laughs> and they call that love. What's love got to do, got to do with it? What's love but a second-hand emotion? She better get herself together. She heard that scripture, a man that find a wife find a good thing and attain it favorites from the Lord. Yeah, he does. Great juice, orange, all of that favorites. Yes, I know the scripture. I know the scripture. <laughs> Like this today, Lord. No, I don't feel like this today. Who is it? Uh oh. They Negro knocking around here. We're gonna have to get some right. These neighbors. Somebody speak. Who's that peep through the window? Nobody now. Oh. This woman gonna be the death of me. Look, what do you want? Can I come in so we can talk? Jackson, please. C- come on, you heating up the outside. My grandma always told me to shut the door behind. You know what? You got five minutes. Jackson, I've been giving it some thought and I made a huge mistake. <laughs> what that supposed to do for me? Look, I know you're upset, okay? And look, you have every look, right to be, look, but- Look, 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 can you please get straight to the point? Look, Jackson, I still love you, and I want us to try to make this work. He dumped you, didn't he? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) It's not that funny. Oh, you... (laughs) What I supposed to do? Take you back? Yeah. Or at least see me. We can hang out and, you know, maybe Netflix and chill. Ha, we can't do none of that. I, I just supposed to let you back up in here? Yeah. No, we ain't doing none of that. We can't let you back in me and Courtney like, no, you know what? I ain't even going through that with you. Not no more, not ever. Peace. Jackson. Lynn, you know, listen, I gave you everything. Jackson, you're hurting me. You didn't hurt me. I tried loving you, Jackson, I did. When you try, no matter of fact, 
When you love someone, when you take vows, you don't try to love them. That comes naturally. But I needed more than you were able to provide. You needed more than I was able to provide. I gave you everything. You was just too blind to see it. Jackson, baby. You know, if I was to beat you up, cuss you out, do all foul things, you would love my dirty drawers with me. You are a liar. No. I have to stand here and take this. Oh, you going to stand here and you going to take it. See, I had, to, I had so many opportunities to cheat on you, but I never did. I put you before everything. You know what? They ain't even far enough. You know what? <laughs> no, nah, uh uh. I came here to talk to you so that we can get past this and try to work something out, but I see all you want to do is talk bad about me. So you know what? That is far from enough. Oh, you think I'm it's far from enough? I see, one thing, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I said, wait. <laughs> see, you might meet some guys that'll take you out. Buy you nice, uh uh, don't get too comfortable. Please, don't sit on my trash. As I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted by your lazy legs. You might meet guys that'll take you out, fancy restaurants, wine and dine you, buy you nice things. But eventually, they gonna see right through you for the shallow person that you are. That will never happen to me. 459, four minutes. Ding, 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 that's five minutes. I just seen through you. You can leave my house. You know what? Let huh. me tell you something, Mr. Husband of the Year. That's Mr. Me. Perfect Father. That's me too. You think you're the only good man in this world? <laughs> you treat me good. I get that. <laughs> and you provided for me. Yeah. Somewhat. But don't sit here and act like you deserve a cookie or something. Cause guess what, Jackson? You did what you supposed to do. And don't you ever put your hands on me. You know. You know. <laughs> Cannon to the left of them. Cannon to the right of them. Bravo. The hood rat finally comes out. You know what? This little pipe dream that you have of being the next Johnny Cochran. <laughs> It's not gonna happen. Nope, not at all. Cause guess what? I was fine before you. <laughs> I will all be fine after you. Remember that. Bye, Felicia. Bye, Frank. Gosh, Connie, could you please stop changing the channel so much? This is my house, and I'll watch whatever I want to watch. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Courtney, what is wrong with you? Because you're acting very stink, and I don't like it. Very stink, to be honest. I was thinking the same thing. You've been really mean lately. Well, if you don't like it, there's the door. You can leave. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm out of here. Wait, I don't got nowhere to go. Exactly. So you can have a seat, and you can tell her that you're sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't need it. I know. I wasn't leaving anyway. What's wrong with you? Come on, Courtney. You can tell us. Yeah, you can tell us. We won't tell anyone. Oh, uh, Sydney, speak for yourself. I can't make that promise. Shut up, Brandy. You shut up. You just want to be down because your name is Brandy. I just want to be down. Girl, don't hit Brandy. No attention. What is it? You can tell us. It's just my dad insisted a divorce three months ago. He's been really sad about it. Are you sad about it? No way. I didn't even like her from day one. She was always nice to me. You didn't have to live with her. She wasn't nice to me or my dad. Then you should be glad she's gone. Trust me, I'm glad. I'm just worried about my dad. All he does is work, come home, help me with my homework, and then goes back to his room. Well, maybe you can introduce your dad to someone and take his mind off the divorce. That's a good idea, but how do you know your dad is ready to date again? Why, did you have someone in mind? My mom's single. Courtney, look at me. Don't touch her mama. I seen her before. I met your mom. And there's a reason she's single. Ha ha, you got jokes. Don't let the prison record fool you. My mom's a good woman. A1, ride or die. Even perfect. Just not for this topic. Whatever. So, Cindy, who did you have in mind? I was thinking Miss Wilson. She's single. Our math teacher, Miss Wilson? Yeah, that Miss Wilson. My dad cannot date our teacher. And would you like to tell us one, two, three, and four why your daddy can't date our teacher? I would just like to know.
because she's our teacher, just stating the obvious. Well, I mean, you could get A's on your test and everything. <laughs> hmm. Maybe they should date. <laughs> I need to really get out of... Y'all girls up to something. Who? Us? Not me. me. <laughs> yeah, one, two, three, four, and five. Definitely five. I know her mama. I told, I told you. Mr. Thomas, my mom told me to tell you she said hello and that you're welcome to stop by for dinner sometime. No. Her mama? Yep. yep. Say hello to me? Yes. And, and, and won't take me out to dinner? Don't, yes. Yep. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't no. Do it. No. 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 Listen. <laughs> Who? Tell your mama I said hello. Tell her I said thank you. But that won't be happening. I just seen your mom on CNN. I don't feel like going to jail tonight, okay? <laughs> no. Listen, I'm going to step out for a minute. As you can see, I'm going out shopping for a new woman. Back on the chopping block. Y'all enjoy yourself, okay? Okay. Pat her down before she leaves. Oh, my gosh. Brandy, you might as well get the thought out of your head. My dad is not dating your mom. Okay, can we stop talking and do this homework, please? I agree, because I have things to do. Just listen, Courtney. Just know that your dad's going to be fine without that crazy lady named Miss Lynn. And I'm sure that when the time is right, God will send someone just right for both you and your dad. You know, you guys are right. I remember a song my grandma used to sing me. Well, sing? What is it? Actually, I would like a bomb pop. You still sell those? The yeah, red, white, and the blue ones? I think we got some bomb pops today. Okay, got what can I do for you right here? Excuse me, I'm not with him. Uh oh. Ooh. I'm sorry, you two <clears throat> just look like you were together today. Hmm. Mm. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, Did you see? Hey, never mind. What she's having, put it on my tab. All right, so Excuse me, me, I have my own money. Actually, what he's having, you can put it on my tab. Okay, no problem. Gotcha. Got your usual coming right up. Thank you. you know, do you always turn down men trying to buy you ice cream? Um, just today. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Thank you very much, hey. though. I'm not usually offered. I mean, don't say I didn't try. I guess. You know, hey, what was your name again? You didn't ask me my name. I apologize. My name is Jackson. Hello, Mr. Jackson. I'm Sean, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, the pleasure is definitely all mine. <laughs> I've not seen you around here. Oh, well, you know, I just started working across the street about six months now. Oh, I walk across the street, too. Serious? Yeah. What do you, what do, you do over there? I'm on the 15th floor, actually. 15th floor? 15th floor? Yeah. That's right in Collins, the top law firm in the city. Bingo. Are you the secretary? I have my own secretary. Oh, I apologize then. Go ahead, get them then, girl. Well, what do you do? Well, I've been there for six months. I'm a new lawyer over there. Okay. Well, you seemed a little surprised about me working on the 15th floor. I apologize. I'm surprised at all. I mean, are you surprised at the fact that I'm black and I'm a woman? Or? <laughs> Actually, both. Oh, okay. Well, I guess being a lead defense attorney at uh -oh. a top profile law firm, I mean, that could be shocking the most. I guess I could... See, no. I'm doing all right. Actually, I'm impressed. Okay. Well, 
impressed with the fact that I'm single or that I'm a lawyer? <laughs> really? That's just what you came up with? I, I couldn't with? resist. It was a joke. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm impressed by all of that. I mean, you, and you're good looking. Well, thank you. You didn't say that. <laughs> thank you. You're not too bad yourself. Well, you know, I try. <laughs> well, it's a pleasure to meet you. Likewise. Hey, you know what? Oh, th thank you. This, this ain't no red, white, and blue, though. Yeah, I got you next yeah. time. Next time. Yeah, we These ran out of popsicles. Oh, there you go. Look, we ran out of ice cream today. Okay. Uh, that's all right, you know. Well, I need to be getting out of here. I apologize, you know. Hey, you don't mind if I take you out sometime, do you? Uh, no. I don't mean to be so straightforward, but, you know. You are a little straightforward, and you keep looking back here. I I'm just checking you out, though. <laughs> yeah. But that's okay. That's okay. It's nice to meet you. Sure, I would love to go out. No problem. You know, I really need to get back to work. So okay. I'll catch you later on. Me too. Let's do it. Awesome. All That's right. You don't have any deep, dark secrets now, do you? It's a little soon to be asking about No, no. Nah, I got to get that out the way right now. No. <laughs> no, I don't have any deep, dark secrets. You sure? I am sure. You positive? I'm positive. Oh, whew. It was a pleasure meeting you. It's a pleasure meeting you. I, I am honored. To be in your okay, presence. have a good day. Cool. All right then. Hey, I need those bomb pop. I got you next time. All have right a good one. Thanks for coming. Yep, you too. It's good to see you. Hello? Hey, Dad. No, I didn't forget your robe. I'll be sh Yes, I'll bring it. I'll bring it. And yes, I, I remember. You're singing. Okay, choir. Yes, I got choir rehearsal. Yes, I remember. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. Okay, love you. Bye. Girl, you better quit playing with him. He was all right, wasn't he? And he got shmoney. Does okay? he got shmoney? Shmoney. Shmoney? Like Cardi B? Like Cardi B. These ain't bloody shoes. <laughs> you better go now. Yes. Somebody got this boy out Duncan Hines booed up and he can't wow. even call his boy. Man, y'all is it. You know what? Y'all need y'all own comedy show. B and T. I see it. You know, it ain't even nothing like that. You know what? I've been chilling with Sean lately, and I feel good. Listen, what? Let's do it. Wait a minute. There we. Look at this nut. Look at this nut. What's she up? She got you your nose up. so wide open. I can drive my Bentley through that bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> man, you, you ain't, ain't even, even got, got no Bentley, man. Listen, I mean my Honda. <laughs> like my Honda. <laughs> but can you blame me? No, you know, a girl got it going on. She got that curvature. Nobody curvature. asked you to do that. I'm, I'm sorry. She looks very nice. Very pilly. What is curvature? <laughs> what? Man, look, dude. No. You ever have a woman that just grabs your attention? Mm -hmm. Like she just, oh my God, she holds on to my soul. You ever had that? Your soul? My soul, brother. That's <laughs> Man, that's what. She got that, ooh, boy. <laughs> what did he I knew my boy got it. See, you knew it. Off, See, that's your man. I knew though. it. That's your, I know Why guys. Why you ain't tell us? I know guys come around, it, we man. talk about, man, listen. He's still right here. It's he, impossible. I told you, he's Look, trying to hide it. No, actually, mm -hmm. I know we guys get together and we kind of talk about that. And play mm -hmm. play and you know we do, yeah. Real talk, we ain't even been on that level yet. Whoa! Hey, Trace, did huh. you hear that, man? You, you seen me? Maybe <laughs> if you took a page from old Action Jackson's book, man. Action yeah. Jackson? To put shoes. Maybe you get a call back for a second date, man. I done told y'all jokers, all I need is 24 hours, one day. That's it. You gonna, you gonna you catch gonna something. You gonna catch something. That's terrible. <laughs> That's the same. You nasty. Real talk, though. She coming through later on. Uh, yeah? <laughs> yeah. We better go. We better go. You about to get it. Oh, man, no, man. What is she coming by for, man? Man, oh, she coming by. I'm going to introduce her to court. Dig that. Dig that. What? Did this clown just say he about to introduce her to Courtney? Did you not just hear him when what? he just said it when he was standing there? He was standing right here That's when I what said. he said, man. What he said, I don't That's know. Rough. I don't know. Man, listen. I really like her, dude. I and it just, it just took me by surprise how much she just took over my life. That's good, man. But uh, you know, what you gonna do? Like, is it is it is it going places? Do you see it going anywhere, man? man do I? Yeah. What? Yeah, let me. Just how real it is. Uh huh. We talk about our past. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> we even talk about our future. 
I see it. I see it. Look at right. Yes, I see it. You know what? We talk about what's going on right here, man. I mean, nothing's off the table when we get together. Including her. I see. I'm sorry. If you don't knock it off, hey, listen. That's your man. I don't know about that dude, but I'm happy for you. I appreciate it, my brother. You gotta wait, man. Hey, man. Look, I'm glad it ain't me, but I'm happy for you too. I appreciate it. Good to see you, man. But look, hey. We got to roll. We'll see you in a week, man. Yeah, in a week? Yeah. A couple months, bro. A couple months? We'll see you in a year. A year? Hey, at Courtney's graduation, man. Courtney graduation? At the wedding, dog. At the wedding. Hey, man, hey, hey, man. I'm going to see y'all at work tomorrow, man. You ain't even got no job, Tommy. (laughs) Relationship haters. You got to be able to, you got to watch them. Hey, Dad. Uh Uh-oh. Hey, baby, you need a bail or something. You be sneaking up on me like that? Hey, you know what? I need you on your best behavior today. Dad, you know I'm a good kid. Yeah, that can be argumented. I mean, no, baby, you are a good kid. You are excellent. Look at that face. Look at that face. (laughs) (laughs) No, I just really need you on best behavior. My friend's coming by, and I'm really nervous. Why are you so nervous? Because you are my favorite girl in the whole world, and I just really want you to like her. Okay. Awesome. Everything clean? Did I sweep up? Do it look good? Yeah. Oh. Hi, look. Get the door. Get the door. Do I? Just get the door. All right. Hey! Hey, beautiful! How are you? I am doing good. good. Oh, good, good to, to see, see you. you. Good to see you. Thanks for the invite. Hey, no problem Hi. at all. Hi. How are you? This is my beautiful Courtney. Courtney, this is the lovely Miss Sean. Hello, Courtney. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi, Miss Sean. It's nice to meet you, too. Oh, my. That's a pretty sweater you have on. Yeah. Thanks. My dad got it for me. Mm, your dad has good taste. You see me, though? And you don't have to call me Miss Sean. You can just call me Sean. What? Uh, hey, you will call her <laughs> Miss Sean. <laughs> Well, what's that smelling in the kitchen? Dad is cooking his famous spaghetti. Mmm. You helped your dad? Just a little bit because he wanted it to be good for you. Uh-oh. Hey, you know, I do put my foot in it. <laughs> hey, what matter of fact, get out of here. You're embarrassing me. <laughs> I'm embarrassing you. She's so mature. She's adorable. Yeah, she's a good kid. I see where she gets her charm from. Hey, you know, I don't know. Uh-oh. Relax. Hell, do I... you have any help with her? Yeah, exactly. You know, I wish I could take all the credit. But my parents do an awesome job with it. Mm, well, I hope to meet your parents one day, too. Uh, real soon. I guess so. Mm, yeah, watch out for Dad, though. Uh-oh. Well, dinner's ready. Dinner is served. Hey, why don't we let our guests do the honors of saying prayer? Oh, okay. sure. Father, we thank you for food and fellowship. We're asking that you cover the food for the nourishment of our bodies. And, God, we're asking that you allow us to have more times together. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, yeah, I was, something was on my shoe. I must have stepped in something or something. Oh. I don't know. Hey, food is served. Let's go enjoy it. Okay. Well, they were no gods, but the work of men's hands, wood and stone. Hey, Dad. Hey, John. How are you? All right. Good to see you, Pop. Good to see you, too. Here's your robe. Thanks. Thanks for bringing my roll for okay. me. Okay. Uh, cleaners and. Uh... Woohoo! Oh. How was your evening with Jackson? <laughs> it was great. He cooked for me, and I got a chance to meet his daughter. Uh, she was a lovely young lady. Oh, really? Yeah. And how old is she? She's 13. Lovely. Wow. Really? Hey, I have an idea. Okay, what's that? You should invite them to church service. Mm. Afterwards, they can come by for dinner. Wouldn't that be nice? Uh, I think it might be a bit too soon. I don't think I should do that yet. Are you ashamed of being the daughter of a preacher? No, no, no. I'm not ashamed. I just want to make sure I do it at the right time. Does he not believe in God, Sean? Dad, it's not that. I just want to make sure I invite him at the right time. He doesn't know that I'm a daughter of a preacher. Okay. Well, then, why don't you do this? Well... And that has a lot to do with you. Do you think you love him? I do. I love him. I love him so much. He's such a good guy, a great dad, and just sweet all around. I just great guy. He, he actually reminds me of you. Oh, well, you know, there, there's a few of us left. Yeah, I, a few. <laughs> Sean, if you love him, you have to tell him. Yeah. And if he cares about you as much as you do about him, then he should understand. 
and it won't change anything. So the last thing you want to do is build a relationship on a lie. Build a relationship on a lie. I promise right. I'll tell them. I just need to tell them on my own time. Hey, that's great. Yeah. Hey, let's go take care of uh, Sunday. Sunday? Yes. Sunday. Are you always getting me to work on Sunday, Pop? Yes, we got Sunday school. And why don't you fix your tie? Oh, what's My wrong? dad, it's, it's wrong. Smoke? Yeah. Put your bald head. My dad. Might be my thing. Hey, hey. Hey. How are you I'm doing? I'm good. How are you? I am doing great. Thanks for the invite. Hey, no problem I'm at all. I'm so glad you got me out of the office. I was running late. I'm sorry about that. That's okay. Have a seat. Over Make here. You want me to sit home. over here? Oh, you didn't want yes. me to sit in that chair? No, nah, not at all. Uh -oh. no, my dad probably made a mistake in that chair. <laughs> okay. He was coming back. Okay. Have a seat. What's going on? Ah, nothing. I was just thinking about you. I was thinking about you. Were you? Yeah. I'm having a great time. Just <laughs> a great space. I won my third case in a row. And now I'm here with you. Life couldn't be better. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, well, you're not so bad yourself though i mean you on your way to the top to the top oh you didn't stood up uh-huh okay you on your way to the top <laughs> I'm, at, I'm at the top and you about to be the top lawyer in michigan i want you to know i believe in you <laughs> yeah the top lawyer man. <laughs> you know you believing in me that means so much to me well i'm glad you know we're on this real real good trip with us me and you together yeah we make one heck of a power couple couple uh-oh well, what do you mean, couple? Did I, did I say something wrong? <laughs> no. I'm, well, you just kind of sent me by surprise. Is well, that your listen. way of asking me to be your woman? I mean, you know I really like you, right? Okay. And when you're not around, I can't stop thinking about you. Hmm. Well, you're not alone. I feel the same way about you. Uh, I am. That is a relief. Uh, I was hoping you wanted more than just friendship. Yes, I want more than friendship. I've been wanting a lot more than friendship. Uh, whew. You know what? I trust you. You trust me. I trust you with my heart. I trust you with my Courtney. Uh-oh. Well, I, w I don't know what to say. I mean, just tell me you love me. I love you. Do you love me? Hey, Sean. I, Mr. Jackson Tom, I love you, girl. Okay. Well, I love you, too. Hey. But it's something I want to tell you. Hey, long as it don't break what we got going on right here, you can tell me anything. Well, I, um, well, I want to tell you I love you. Oh. And, um... You, we ain't been doing nothing. We ain't been having sex. We've been holding out for Jesus. Yeah. Mm. And um, I just want to say thank you. I mean, you've really been waiting before marriage. Yeah, it's, it's been hard. Uh-oh. Woo. Well, thank you. But listen, you don't need to thank me. Okay. I mean, what we got going on right here, right now, this is perfect. And I know this is special. Okay. So you don't have to thank me at all. Okay. Cool? Yeah. We can bounce out here? I guess so. What are we going to get? I don't know. We can get some Popeyes or something. Uh-oh. I'm a big girl. We can I bounce like up to out eat. Here. Come on. Popeyes. You want me to rap a little Kim or something? Yeah, rap me some Kim. Hey. You know I got you, though. Uh-huh. Don't test me. Yup. Don't you test I mean? me. Hey, yo, shorty, why don't you come get a bag of the weed, too? Hey. <laughs> Whew. Oh, there's so much need to be done around here. Hey, Dad, you left your Hey, laptop. baby. Oh, I know I was looking for that. Also, don't forget about my game today. Oh, you know I will not forget about your game. I am working from home today, and Sean will be by. We will definitely be there to see you, okay? Okay. All right. Love you. Love you, too. Do good. I will. See you soon. Woo. Hello, oh, Courtney. You look beautiful. Oh, so now I look beautiful? Yeah, whatever. Hello there, Mr. Thomas. Looking good, looking good. Oh my God, what do you want? You, what, why are you here? Can I get a hug from my ex-husband? Oh, you cannot get a hug from your... What do you want? You still haven't told me what do you want. Yeah, take your time. It's all right. I got all day. Unlike what the other dude told me. Look, I've been putting some thought into this, and I really think we should get our family back together. What, what family? <laughs> You, me, Courtney. <laughs> Jackson, baby, you am, okay? Am I being punk? <laughs> Serious, is that little boy gonna jump out here with that camera? Cause if he do, I'm gonna kick his in. Jackson, I'm serious. I've really been putting some thought into this and 
I don't want that lifestyle. I want you. Oh, I get it. Did, did he? No. You know, unfortunately for you, I will not allow you to come back in me and Courtney's life. That just when I work. Jackson. Lynn, thank you for stopping by. Jackson. Uh, I'm listening. But think about how well we can be now that you're a lawyer. Ah, uh, I'm a lawyer. Uh, See, me working. Sky that little, is the limit. Uh, that sky, mm -hmm. yeah. The sky is the limit. Mm -hmm. That's how I feel. You know, you know what? Me working that little nine to five job and me going to school wasn't good enough for you. But now that you think I'm this big lawyer, you want to come back into me and Courtney's life, huh? No, that's not it. Yeah, that's exactly it. So, what's new with you? Jackson. Yes. Seriously. Mm-hmm. If we start over, right? Mm-hmm. We can start with just hanging out, kicking it. You know, just talking on the phone, a little Netflix and chilling. I come over. You know how we used to do. Maybe if we just start from the beginning. Oh. You know? Yeah. So you did that with your boo mm. up in here. Why are you bringing up the past, baby? Oh, my God. That's, why are you bringing up old stuff? Oh, that's old. Yeah, that's old. Okay. Well, listen. I don't need you to be snooping around here because I moved on and I'm happy. Move on, huh? Yeah. Huh. I saw your little girlfriend at the hair salon. <laughs> Stalker. <laughs> Jackson. Hmm? She's not your type. And uh, what type is that? <laughs> She's not your type, honey. <laughs> you, mm. So I guess. What do you like about her? I mean, she's honest. Hmm. She's trust, trust, mm -hmm. trustworthy. Mm-hmm. And that's more than I can say about you. Hmm. Sounds like a puppy. That's real cute, Jackson. <sighs> you know, I got too much work to do around here to be putting on with you. You know, the same way you came in is the same way you can leave. Jackson. Lynn. Jackson. Lynn. Baby, hmm? don't you remember from the beginning, like, how it was when we first met? When we first started dating and we didn't have, like, bills and, you know, you wanted to take over your family business? Uh... I do not. Don't you remember, Jackson? That there was a time when I, don't you, baby, didn't have no one, didn't have no love. Do you the chance to love you again and I make your heart forget I was in a band if we forget the past then I know this time love will last forever <laughs> Just throw those bad memories out, baby. You know. And look, make this a thing forever. He says he loves the way I am. Jackson. Jackson.
Jackson? Baby? Oh, my mom, I'm glad she gone. Let me get out of my house. She studies. Where did she go? I know she ain't then came back. It's about to go down. Messing up my woman pictures. Back at my door. I bet she better not be up. Didn't I tell you to? Uh oh. Hey. Did I catch you at a bad time? Oh, or no, 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 no. Not at all, Mrs. Wright. How is how everything going? That was kind of rude. Oh, I Mr. apologize. Top Kids lawyer? just running around here knocking on my door, running away. It ain't even Halloween trick or treat. Never mind that. Do you have the papers my secretary asked for? I do. I do. That is awesome. We will make oh. copies of these and we will get them right back to you. So, do it look like I have a case? Yes, you do. We read the police report and the summary of what occurred. We're going to get right on it, and we will proceed with your case. That's what I'm talking about, because my funds are very low. And your I'm... funds are low? Never mind that, Mrs. Wright. What we're going to do is reimburse you 100% of everything that you lost. Awesome. Awesome. That sounds good. You know that what I need good. you to do? What's that? I just need you to sign right here. Oh, yeah. Right yeah. where the dotted line I is. Do that. And we will get that. Uh oh, I don't worry about it. I get it. I get it. Hold up. Let me sign this because I need my money. Mm hmm. Okay. I'm going to put this down. Uh, but, uh, this your wife. Did she <laughs> no, kill? that's not my wife. But she do has great potential. That's not your. You just got cute girls just laying around. Well, Hold on. Know. Wait I a do. minute. You know. It's, her name's Sean. Huh? Yes, that's, that's, that's Sean. Okay. Um, you, you know her from somewhere? Sean Reed? Shoot. You. You know her from somewhere? Okay. Um, we go to church together. Oh. We go to Mount Olive Baptist Church over there on First Street. You, Mount you know, Olive Baptist You know what? Um, what was his name? He had to step Minister down. Minister Smith. Smith. Yes. Smith. Yes. Oh, no, her brother. dad took over. Her, when he had to, okay. her father's a minister. Okay, look like I know. And she, yeah, oh. you just stepped in something one too okay. many times. <laughs> okay. Well, you know we, what? I, we gonna make sure we, you don't I step into nothing. Money, you know what? So hey, gonna, hey, 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 hey. You know, she out. did tell me about her father. It, it slipped my mind. Don't no worries. We're gonna get right on this, you and sure? we're gonna take care of you. Yes, I ain't messed up nothing. No, you ain't messed up nothing okay. at all. I need my money. You, didn't, you, you, you gonna get your money. Okay. Well, you you definitely gonna get your money. Okay. Well, thank you, Mr. Jackson, hey, it so is much my for everything. Pleasure. Oh, yeah. Tell Sean I see her at church Sunday. Oh, I'm gonna tell Sean. You can bet that. You're awesome. Thank yeah, you. Uh -huh. You have a good day. <laughs> Tell me about it. Tim. Hello? Hey. Hey, you? What's going on? How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing good. Now, um, if you're not too busy, can you come by? We need to talk about something. Absolutely. Sure. All right. Take your time now, all right? Okay, cool. Cool. Tell me about her daddy. <laughs> Tell me about her daddy. Daddy's a, is a minister. And she in the choir up at that church. Hey. Hey. How are you? I am doing good. Good. Uh-huh. I'm so glad you got me out of that office. I was just thinking about you. Are you? Uh, what was you thinking about? I was just thinking about how happy I am. Yes. I'm so in love and it's so refreshing. You know how they talk about like the in love infatuation yeah. stage. Uh -huh. I just love you, but you call me over here. What's going on? I did. I was, um, me and Courtney is going to the movies uh, Sunday. Would you like to go along with us? This, this Sunday? Yeah, this Sunday, the day between uh, Saturday and Monday. Well, can I, can I get back to you on that? I want to check my schedule. To get back to you. Oh, baby, your man on the schedule now? Oh, you is killing them. I am on the schedule. Imagine that. Well, can I, I just, I, it's something I want to tell you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> tell me, I'm listening. Well, are you going to hear me out, though? I got two ears. Okay. Um, my dad is the preacher over at um, Mount Olive Baptist Church. Baptist and... Baptist. He, he's the preacher there, and I think that's the church you used to go to. Yeah. But I'm the choir director there, too, and the they meet me there this Sunday. You do they. 
do they need you there what this is- Sunday? I mean, you couldn't find a time to tell me your father was a minister of a church that I left, and then you are the choir director. You couldn't find time to tell me that. You know what? You are really selfish. Well, wait a minute. I, I wanted to tell you. I was trying to tell you at the right time. At the right time. I didn't want it to come in between what we had. What, what we had. What you mean, <laughs> what, what we what had? What we had. Exactly what I said. It was here. Now it's gone. It's gone just like that? Just like that. So you mean to tell me what my father does affects you so much to where you just want to walk away? You never loved me anyway. You know what? It's not what your father does. And you're not going to switch this around on me either. You a liar. I don't deal with liars. Well, that, that's, a, that's a strong word. No, liar. No, liar. L. Well, let me tell you something, something. Jackson. Because you're pointing fingers and you're calling me a liar. I wanted to tell you at the right time because I know how you feel about the church. But besides that, it sounds like you're trying to make me pay for what your ex-wife did. Huh. I'm trying to make you pay for what my ex-wife did. Yes, that's what I said. Now, let me say what I need to say. It sounds like you're trying to make me pay for what your ex-wife did. And did it ever occur to you that maybe God was trying to show you that you made the wrong decision? I made the wrong decision? Yes, you made the wrong decision. The only wrong decision I made was trusting you. I had you around my Courtney all up in my house, and you studied lying to me. You couldn't find, I couldn't find the right time. Serious? You know what? The same way you came in, Sean, you can leave. I guess you used to sending women away, but let me tell you something. You ain't going to send me away till I'm well, ready. I, I was... Let me say what I need to say. I'm sick of your little pity party, and as long as you hold on to the past, you ain't going to ever move forward. You need to get your act together. Now I'll leave. Turn his TV on, everybody clapping and laughing. Man, oh man. Woo. man. Y'all still go for the Lions? No, never. Man, that is never. Uh-uh. Oh, Who you God. go for? I don't know. I used to like that blue and silver team. Man, I'm with the, I'm with the Pats all day. You know Brady the man. I do with like the dent in his chin. With the, serious? That's a superpower. He blow it up to get the po- <laughs> That's your man. Oh. <laughs> that is your man. That's why man. I can't watch football with you. you. You feel me? For real. But you know what, though? Jack. Hmm? Did you tell uh, Brian about the argument you had the other day with your girl? Serious? I mean, he need to know. We doing that right now? He just need to know. I don't... Man, you are strong. What happened, bro? <laughs> man, listen. Honestly, I don't even want to talk about it. Look at it. I see him. Look at it. Mm-hmm. You know he done messed up. For real. Look at that face. <laughs> Dude, can we drop it? I don't want to talk about it. Dog, she was a good look for you, man. She was a good girl. She had you smile. He even said your nose was open, man. I liked her for you, man. Looks can be deceiving. <laughs> I feel you. Girls like that <laughs> always got something to hide. You I told me? you about the curvature. Man, what are you doing? What are you doing? Are we not serious right now? That's your man. M- never mind that. What was she hiding, bro? Let's just say she ain't who she claimed to be. <laughs> I knew it. It's them pretty ones. She was a stripper. She what? Was a stripper. Oh my God, I it, bro! Man. Would you and be? She ain't break you off. That's your man. Serious. No money. That's your man. Serious, right serious now, man. Too. That's man. your man's right be now. Be serious. Man. No, it ain't that, man. I've been at the vending machine. <laughs> <laughs> it's her daddy, man. Family doing it together. Dad and pops are strippers. What can you do? What are you doing? So. Daddy, daughter, daddy, daughter. No, man. I, I see the flyer on cars. Would you not? What did you? That, whatever, man. That's your man's. What does her father got to do with you, man? Brace yourself. I'm bracing. Her father is a pastor. <laughs> no. Really? That ain't no. Really? Yeah. That's the reason to walk away. Well, that's you know I don't do. deal with them type of people. That's Bro, the best you could come up with. That's that's it. That's what he got. That's what he got. If you want to move forward, my G, you got to let that bitterness go, man. Man, whatever, man. I ain't got to let nothing go. I, I smell it, too. You put, s- put your shoes on, man. You no, smell it, something? It's that... It's, it's that... Wait, okay, hold on. Here yeah, we go. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. let me get this straight before uh-huh. I even bring you there. Hmm. Because Lynn's... Che- or Lynn cheated on you mm-hmm. with a pastor. Yes, yes, mm-hmm. yes. Say it, say it, say it. And Sean's... Father is a pastor? Preach, preach up preach, in him. Preach it, preach it, preach it. You don't want nothing to do with her? Nothing. 
There's some ignorance. What? Some stupid. Man, that's the what? dumbest thing I've ever heard, man. And you ain't getting none. The dumbest. I mean, why you had to throw that in there? Because cause it's true. You, Serious? You, you're not getting none. That's how we feeling. Yeah, man, I mean, listen, man. I don't care what y'all say, how y'all feel. Y'all sitting around here talking like little females. Hey. I thought we was going to play ball. You the one started it and your jump shot sucked. You got one more time to call me a female. Who jump shot? Your... Yours, Jack. This guy right here. You built this wall with all these bricks you laying. <laughs> That's why you sing. Damn TV is always up. <laughs> Man, that was a good game. That was a good game. Told you them boys can't rock. Them boys can't rock at all. Oh my God. Yes, Jackson, it's me. Robin, what, what do you want? I came over here to talk to you. If you come to talk to me about Lynn, I do not want to hear that. I did not come here to talk to you about Lynn. I came here to talk to you about you. And what it is about me this time? Sit down. I don't want to sit down. Sit down. All right. Now, I know you think because Lynn was my best friend, I was okay with what she was doing. I mean, birds But I wasn't. I told Lynn, you mess with that pastor, something wasn't going to be good for her. I told her that, but I came here to tell you, Jackson, you have got to learn to forgive. Well, I got to be the one to forgive because all the time. Because if you don't, you will never truly be able to love again. Love. She said, love, God, love, God. What is, what is, Listen, always... I heard about your new boo. Say <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I heard about her. Yeah. And I heard that you were willing to let her go over something so simple and small. Willing she gone. Already. If you love her, Jackson. <laughs> You gotta go after her. Yeah. You can't give up on her that easy. Whatever. I, I mean, what, I, I, what do you know about God? Don't cut me off again. Now, to answer your question, you may think I may not know that much about God because of some of the stuff that I've done, <laughs> but I know that God is a forgiving God. It's God. And we want to be like him, so you got to be forgiven too. Stop. Listen. I'm so done with God. Jackson, if you don't let go of this hurt, if you don't let go of this pain, it's not going to be good for you. Now, I came over here to encourage you. Sure. But sometimes, boy, you got to encourage yourself. Sometimes you, you have to encourage yourself. Sometimes you, you have to Look, man, oh my, you know what? Girl, I didn't think, you can sing. Oh, I know, I know, I know. No, 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 no. You can't sing, girl, you can sing. Listen, listen, Jackson, stay focused. Get your girl back. I gotta go get my new car. I'm gone, okay, bye-bye. Your new car, did she just tell me? Forgive. You got to learn to forgive, Jackson. Baby. Are you ready to let the saints of God hear that beautiful voice? The, the singing, but I guess so. What's the matter, babe? Something wrong? No, everything's fine. 
Where's Jackson? Is your friend here today? He couldn't make it, but maybe next week. Hmm. That would be good. We need more men, more role models, and good fathers in the church. Lord knows we need more soldiers. Hey, you think he'd be interested in helping us out? Dad, can we drop it? Don't we have a service to prepare for? We can drop it for now, Sean, but we will talk about this later. Dad, I said I'd rather not discuss it. I might not even see him again. I'm sorry, baby, but I'm sure God knows best. Dad, would you stop with all this God stuff? It's ever since I was younger, it's always been God this and God that. And now I'm here, I met the man of my dreams, and I can't even stay with him because of what a man of God did. Wait a minute, baby. I'm not just going to stand here and let some man break your heart. Your mom and I raised you right. We raised you to have a relationship with God. Just because you're a believer doesn't mean there'll be no trials and no tribulations. Everybody that claims to preach God's word isn't called by God. And even those that are called by him fail sometimes. <laughs> Pastors are people too, you know. I understand. So, My faith is not wavering. Baby. I believe God will do all of this and whatever you're saying. But it's just, Jackson is so hurt because of what a man of God did. Best thing you can do is pray for him. <laughs> now you got my sign aside club, Sean. <laughs> Here, take this handkerchief. Yeah, I don't want your, I don't want your dingy napkin. <laughs> it's the same jeans. It's just come came on. for me and your mama. And I asked you to not talk about it. Woo-hoo, woo-hoo-hoo. That was a good ride over here, Thanks for inviting me out, baby. <laughs> oh, no problem, baby. Mukasa, <laughs> Mukasa. Make yourself comfortable, no, you girl. you the album. <laughs> you sure is strong. You, you all right? I am. What we about to do, Netflix and chill or something? No, <laughs> you all right? I am. Well, you, you is excited. I am. Okay, all right, calm down. We in the house now. Okay. All right. I mean, you was loud at the movies. I thought I was quiet. I tell my kids, use your inside voice. Yo, kids? Yeah, you play your cards right. You might be my 10th baby daddy. <laughs> 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 That's a deal breaker. We can't, we don't. Uh, we're hey. not breaking no deals okay, up in here. Okay, we ain't gonna break no deals up. Oh, damn, baby, <clears throat> Ooh, I am perched. You want something to drink? I got it right here, boo. <laughs> I bought you one. <laughs> I bought me one too. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of. I mean, I, I drunk out of yours a little bit. I hope you don't mind. <laughs> you, you got ten days, baby, dad. Do you drink it out of my, nine, baby? And you drink it out of mine? You know I mean, what? You know, you know, don't worry about it. Whew. It's just a preview for the kiss I'm gonna give you later. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm excuse myself. I'm gonna go in here and get us some snacks. No, I got the snacks right here, bro. <laughs> it makes my hair in my nose. <laughs> Look, I was not gonna be having you pay no $8 to get us some snacks and no drinks because I could go towards you getting my nails or my head did or something. Wait, 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 wait. I, I got to get your hair and your nail did. These just leave press on nails, they coming back. I ain't even asking for acrylic. You, you know, you know, don't, don't even worry about it. Don't, okay. you know what I'm gonna do? I'm, I'm gonna go back here. I'm gonna get everything situated for us back here. Okay, I'm gonna take care of you, girl, Hurry today. Back. You know and I'm gonna go talk to a man about a dog. You got a dog? <laughs> what are you talking about a dog? He done made me pop one of my nails off. <laughs> Let me call my girlfriend. <laughs> Shut the <heck> up! <laughs> Girl, I done hit the jackpot! <laughs> Girl, he a lawyer. Yes, child. Yes. What I need you to do, I need you to call my kids, tell them to start packing, because we moving on up! <laughs> Yes, we are, girl. Okay, I'll see you later, all right? 
All right, bye. Ooh, this is nice. <laughs> this is real nice. <laughs> I can see all my little cherry running up through here. <laughs> I done brought some snacks over here for him. He's taking all day. Boo! He better hurry up before I steal something. I need a remote control. Ah! He better hurry! Boo! What you do? Oh, I just can't do this no more. This dating thing. Woo! She stole my remote! Get up! Uh -oh. Get up! Hey, hey! How come you ain't been answering your phone? We've been calling you for days. What are you doing here? Those keys are for emergencies only. This is an emergency. You haven't picked up your phone? We were concerned about you. Dad. What's Dad. wrong with you, son? I just want to be left alone. Is that too much to ask? Is this about that new woman you've been dating? You know, I, I just, I really messed up. I can't. I, son. That was the happiest that I've seen you in a long, long time. Whatever the problem is between you two, you need to make it right. I mean, I don't know how. I don't. Ho, 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 ho. I got something to tell you. you something to tell I me. got something to tell you. I, I don't want to Your hear daddy got you. something to tell you. Be quiet. Listen, listen, listen. What I'm getting ready to tell you, son, it's a secret. Nobody's ever known this. Nobody. Look, nobody. Nobody. I'm just telling you. you nobody knows. Yeah, nobody out there. They don't know either. It ain't no freaky no, stuff. No, no, no. I can't no, take no, no freaky stuff from you, Dad. No, right no. Now. Well, I mean, they used to call me action back in the day, but not now. Listen to this. Listen to this. Listen to this. When your mother, your precious mama, I just love that woman today. When your mother and I first got together, she kept her inability to have children away from me. Mm-hmm. And this was after I had told her, I kept saying how great it would be, how proud I would be to have a son. Mm. And after a while, she didn't get pregnant. I got myself up. I took myself to my doctor. I had myself checked out and everything. Yeah, you checked it out. Everything good, son. Okay. Good, good. I'm, I'm still standing tall here. All right. <laughs> everything is good with me. So can you imagine... I saw, I saw that the fact was, the problem was with her. Mm. Can you imagine the hurt I felt when I knew we couldn't have any children at that time? Whoa, wait, am I adopted? No, you're not adopted. Sit back down. I'm not done yet. This is, this is the story, more to this story. Let me tell you why. Son, she didn't tell me because your mother was concerned about me. Your mother has great love for me. She's been putting up with me all these years. Your mother loved me. Mm -hmm. she, she kept that away from me, but she didn't want me to know because she was concerned about my feelings. So you saying the reason she didn't tell me is because she was protecting my feelings? She was protecting your feelings just like your mother did with me. Let me tell you something. That's, that's a great love when somebody loves you like that. Hmm. Listen to me, son. Listen to me. I don't... Listen now, listen to me. When, listen to me. This is, this is the other part of the story. After, after she had that medical procedure done and had that little snip, then she could conceive mm -hmm. and, and you were born. Oh, okay. So now do you understand that? So I the understand. whole story, but listen. If I hadn't have forgiven her, if mm -hmm. I, I if I had kept on being reckless and everything towards my feeling toward her, we never would have got back together and you wouldn't be here today. So, so remember that. This is about forgiveness. This is about forgiveness. You know what? I'm going to go get that woman. That's, that's right. Do you love her, Jackson? Uh, you know what, Dad? I love her. Well, let me tell you something. You love her that much, you should move mountains. Oceans, everything to go get that woman. Okay. But before you do, uh, okay, you got to clean this messy house up. Get your broom, get your mop, clean it up, and bring it to a nice, clean home. Everything's going to be fine, son. Oh.
Thanks for your advice, Dad. You're welcome. Y'all ain't gonna keep coming in my house. Hey, hey, you my me. son. Yes, sir. I'm right. your son. We ain't even gotta go to Maury about that. There you I'm go. I'm your son. Little small procedure, snip, snip. There you go. Yo, son. You don't talk disrespect my house like that. Like my house nasty. Ain't nothing wrong with my house. Then everybody come over here checking me. Forgiveness, Jackson. Hey, Tracy. Thank you for meeting me here. What's going on, Sean? Well, I, I know you're real close to Jackson, so I have some questions for you. I've been trying to get through to him. Um, did he tell you what happened? He told me. Why didn't you tell him up front? Well, He's been through a lot these past few years. Well, I know that. I wanted to tell him at the right time. I know he's heard about the preachers and all of that, so you get it. Did you think he would never find out? Come on, Sean. No, I knew he would. I knew he would know. I knew he would find out. But I wanted to make sure I told him when we were good in, in the relationship, and it wouldn't even affect him like that. But you thought you could keep coming up with excuses for you and two to be together on Sunday? Come on now. I never meant to hurt Jackson, Tracy. Look, I'm gonna be honest. At first, I didn't even like you. And it ain't got nothing to do with you, but it's a simple fact that I know what's good for my man. And I didn't want him putting his heart into something that it doesn't work. Well, first of all, I didn't ask you if you like me or not, but I do have a question. What should I do? <laughs> well, there's a couple of things you can do. Okay. okay? First of all, let's get by starting right here. See, I'm a player, and he's the lovey-dovey type. Okay. He's all in his feelings right now, but I truly know that he has his heart there, and he's going he's gonna to open up to you. Okay, okay. You really think so? I know so. I've known this man for 20-plus years. Okay. I know what he's doing right now. He's at home, sitting on the couch, then closed the blinds, singing some Keith Sweat. I want your body. <laughs> Please don't sing. Please don't sing. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Tracy. This is... Uh, give me a hug. Thank you so much. I'm going to get my man back, baby. Listen, no, no, I'm no. getting him back, baby. I want you for the very last round. And I want to some, some, some. I never know what that man be talking about. He be crying so much. Uh-oh, somebody is at my door. It's at my door today. Pa Hello, Jackson. Thanks for seeing me. Pastor Reed, good to see you also, I guess. I mean, Pastor, um, can I ask you why? Why are you making an unannounced visit at my home? I wanted to stop by and talk to you about Sean. You know, honestly, what me and your daughter have going on, I would love that to stay between me and her. I can respect that, Jackson, but I'd like to share something with you. So, I mean, oh, have a seat, young man. Everybody just bossing me around. <laughs> now, I usually don't get into Sean's personal uh, that's life. That's usually when they do. But I feel like this time I really need to step in. I'm aware that she didn't inform you that I'm a pastor, and she, she really is concerned about that, but... I'm not, I'm not going to hold that up against you. Mm-hmm. I mean, but she tells you, she, she told you about me and my wife? Yes. I mean, I, I can't do this. I can't do, how she, she just come and tell you everything about what's going on with me, but tells me nothing about what's going on with you? I'm aware that uh, she hurt you, and she's aware also, and she's, she sympathizes with you, Jackson, but son... Don't turn away from your blessings because of the wrong actions of one man. You're not just mad at them. You're mad at yourself for even allowing this to happen to you. Come on, Jackson. You knew. You knew something was not right about the relationship. But you married her anyway. Yeah. So you need to be able to forgive yourself. Forgive? Yes. What do I do? <laughs> Wait. Okay. Everybody's talking about forgiveness. What happens when I forgive myself? Then you'll be able to forgive others. <laughs> A 
don't be dropping no mic around my house. Hello? Hey. Hey, 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 don't hang up, don't hang up. Is it all right if you stop by the house today? I really need to talk to you. About what? About us. Us? Us, yes. It's, I mean, I, I don't want to talk to you over the phone. I do want to be man enough to talk to you in person. So is it possible, anyway, just finding your heart to come by and talk? Um, yeah, I'll stop by. Okay, um, I'll be here. I'll be, I guess I'll, I'll really be waiting. Okay, cool. Okay, drive safe. Thank you. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Oh, I'm doing good. You look good. beautiful as ever. Thank you. What's going on? Nothing. I was just really thinking about you, and I just really need to talk to you. Well, I wanted to talk to you, too. Uh, I've been thinking about some stuff, and I know I should have told you about my father. I was just trying to find the right time, and, and I, I do love you. I, I miss you, too. You know, that's what I want to talk to you about. Well, well, wait, I got some more to say. The other thing is, I know that a relationship can't be built on a lie. And, and I just wanted to find the right time. I didn't know how to tell you. That's okay. Look, what I really want to tell you with... That's it. That's all you need to say. I love you. I, I mean, have a good wait, one. Wait, 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 baby. Don't go. Don't go. Listen. What I want to tell you is that I deserve you. I think you and deserve it. better. Like, it, I can understand why your friend even said you deserve, you went through a lot. I know what I deserve. And again, I deserve you. Nothing less, but you much more. I mean, because I, I cannot imagine my life without you. So why would I let you get away? Well, you, like I said, you've been through a lot and I just think that you need peace. Maybe somebody can treat you better, you know? You are my better. You are my better. I feel there's nothing that can get better than you. And the crazy part about it is I had a few visitors to show me just how foolish I've been. Well, so you, you had to change your heart and, mm -hmm. and now you're not worried about my dad anymore. <laughs> you know, your dad I can, I can adjust to. But one thing I can't adjust to is you not being in my life. Okay. So, well, tell me about the people that, that came and talked to you. Oh, yeah, like the Christmas thing of past. Remember, you got the old crazy girl, then you got the new girl, then all that crazy. You ever seen that? The no. girlfriends of Christmas past and all that. No. I ain't saying it was some girlfriends. I don't, I don't just share myself around. I'm just saying it gave me an enlightenment on how, really, how stupid I've really been. Oh, so you needed help to see that you were stupid. <laughs> It's my remote. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess, you know, foolish as, as I've been, I really needed some help. And I really like to start over. Oh, you sound silly. Well, how, how will we start over? Picture this. Wing! Oh, God. Yeah, that was dramatic, wasn't it? <laughs> <laughs> hey, my name is Jackson Thomas, and I would like if you would go with me. Okay, I'll go with you anywhere, baby. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Girl. I love it. Hey, where we going? Um, where you want to go now? You want to try churches? 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 Why? Chicken? I got to stop eating all these grease, babe. I know. We got to, we got to work on well, that. Well, let's try Motor City. They got vegetables. Hey, Motor City. Okay. Uh, you get the vegetable, I'm getting the burger. Per burger? They don't got burger at Motor City? Yes, they do. What are you talking about? Oh, you talking about the new Motor City? I'm talking about Motor City where they got like the buffet, all that greasy Oh, see, food. I went to Motor City. got chitlins and all that type of see. stuff. You feel me? Good morning, church. Good morning. It's a beautiful morning to be alive and in the arms of God. Yes, yes, yes. Today's sermon, with the love of God, all things are possible. Yes, yes. I don't think you heard me. Must be preaching to the choir. I'll say it again. Today's sermon is entitled, with the love of God, yes. all all things are possible. Yeah, all yeah, things yeah. Are possible. Amen. The 
Before I bring the word today, yes. we'll have a musical selection. All right. Yeah. Sing, Johnny. Come on. Praise. Come on, put your hands together, church. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, we're going to sing it like this. Yeah. If you can't by the grace of God, let me see you clap your hands. Whoa. Clap your hands. Woo. Clap your hands. Oh. And let the church say it. Wow. Oh, he's been, he's been real good. Oh. And let the church say it. Lord God, he's been, he's been real good. Yeah, he's been, he's been good. Come on. He's been good. He's been good. Oh, he's been good. He's been good. Been real good. Oh, he's been good. Let's give thanks for that beautiful song. Yes. Come on, you can do better than that. Give yes. God the praise. Yes. Yes. Oh, Lord. That song speaks volume to how we should live our lives. You see, we're not a perfect people, but we serve a perfect God. Yes, Lord. And it's because of that same God that we're able to make mistakes, but get back up again. Yes. 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 Preach, Dad. yes. The word tells us that if God can forgive us, yes. mm -hmm. how is it that we're not able to forgive those who have hurt us? Yes, That's right. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Turn to the person on your right and say, I forgive you. I forgive you. <laughs> it's not how many times we count on him. But how many times the Lord counts on us to make this world a better place? Hallelujah. Yeah. Yeah. It's not the man in the robe, but the man in the mirror. Amen. 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 Doors of the church are open. Is there anyone asking for forgiveness? Won't you come? Step out on faith. Yeah. Yeah. Hallelujah. God is good, and God is good all the time. Yes, Welcome, our brother. Yes. Welcome. Yes. Let's take a moment to allow those in a place of darkness to come into the light. Come in if you know that God is able, and he's able to turn things around in your favor. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Is there anyone else asking for favor? <laughs> Amen. Listen, I know I'm the last person you want to see right now. I disrespected your home. I disrespected you as a man. I embarrassed my wife. You did, yep. <laughs> you did. I let my church family down. But I come to you humbly asking you for your forgiveness. Can you forgive me, brother? I forgive you. Thank you, brother. Thank you. God has brought these two spirits together to start the healing process. And now we'll have a song by my daughter. Sean, will you do the honors? Absolutely. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Yes. I want to tell somebody to hang on in there. Can I encourage y'all tonight? Come on, I want you to tell them, hang in there. Turn to your neighbor and say, hang in there. Oh, come on, tell them, hang in there. You can tell somebody to tell them, hang in there. Oh, come on, tell somebody, encourage them, really turn to your neighbor and say, hang in there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh yeah. What you gonna do when your back's against the wall? Yeah. How you gonna smile when it seems I hope is lost? Tell me what you're gonna do when you need a little more grace. 
How you gonna smile when they try to test your faith? I'll sing the chorus right here. Hang on having you in church today. Yes, sir. That was an awesome word, and I knew I was supposed to be there. Ooh. And you too, Courtney. Thank you. That's right, Dad. Miss Sean, you were really singing that song. Thank Ooh. you. you. Thank you. You sung that song. Woman. Thank you. Blessed. You blessed me today. You know, while we all gathered here, I would like to apologize about my attitude, about my temper, the way I've treated everyone over these last couple weeks and months. Baby girl, Thank you for sticking it out with your old man. And mom, thank you for showing me how to stand on God's word. Dad, um... Get over here, son. Get over here with your father. Thank you for being my father. That's right. Hey, and thank you for that awesome word. Absolutely, son. And You're always welcome. And, and creating such a beautiful young lady. Thank you. You mind if I bring you forth? What are you doing? What are you Something doing? Something I should have done such a long time ago. Hey, you're an awesome woman. And from the time that I've met you, you have increased me by so much. I was lost before okay. I met you. And I was out of bounds with God, but you put me back on the court. So to say yeah. that, I would like to say. Uh -oh. <laughs> would you do the honors? <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Would you do the honors of being my wife and keeping me happy for the rest of my life? Absolutely. Oh, son. Oh, son. Oh, son. Oh, son. I thought you were going to say, brother, get out of here with that. Oh, my gosh. Look at yes, it. Yes, no, yes. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Great, you know what? To make this more complete, because I, I come with such a beautiful package. I would like to know if you would marry us. Absolutely, I love Courtney. <laughs> oh my God, my ring. Hey, hey, don't, hey, hey, hey. Don't forget his dad. If you don't remember oh. anything about the broken covenant, remember this. Marriage is a holy covenant, honored and sanctioned by God. The family that prays together stays, stays together. together. Amen. <laughs> and there you have it a broken covenant but I'm about to get into it and introduce the people who made this play a success and I'm going to start with the singers our singing angels Akira Martin now that brother with that 
wonderful voice, Greg Wiley Jr. Also coming to the stage, the lead singer, Sasha Doris. Also coming to the stage, Brianna White. This young lady got a beautiful voice. Also coming to the stage, is Tremaine McNair. All right, all right, this is our singers. Give them a round of applause. They did an awesome job tonight. Now coming to the stage, it's the people that plays in the background, moving the furniture, moving the plots, and all of that. Our stage hands. First, I'm gonna call Brian Bex Jr. Also coming to the stage is Jasmine Lindsay. And I also can't forget my baby, Mackenzie Ford. Future bright star right there. Now to our production assistant, Braylon Taylor. Yes. Also, our assistant producer, Skip Thompson. Yes, sir. Now we're going to get to the cast of the show. Y'all ready? The clerk, Brianna Taylor. Give it up for Bray. Playing the role of Sydney, Demila Sharp. Playing the role of Hannah, Robin Lindsay. Playing the role of Brandy, Denise Samuels. Playing the role of Kayla, Michaela Paul Moore. Y'all, you know we got, look at our babies, they involved in this. See how God work? Now coming to the stage, Mrs. Wright, also strip director, my beautiful wife, Nakia Wynn. Now y'all know we all got one of these in the church. We got one next door. We got them everywhere on the job. We got that nosy neighbor coming to the stage, Wanda Shelby. Playing the role out of the church secretary, Delia Shire. Playing the role of Robin with that beautiful voice, encourage yourself, Demila Prince. Playing the role of Miss Thomas, Deshayla Williamson. Don't she look like a mother? Playing the role of Mr. Thomas, Larry Benton. Check him out, y'all. Watch out now. He going back to the 60s on you. Playing the role of the conscious, reliable friend, Brian, Brian Banks. Playing the role of the player from the Himalayas. Playing the role of Tracy, Justin Howard. Playing the role of the dirty pre preacher, Reverend Smith, Brandon Control. Yes, yes. Playing the role of 
Reverend Reed, Henry, Hank, Lattimore. Playing the role of Courtney. This young lady is so smart and getting ready to do big things. Playing the role of Courtney. Anaya Howard. Playing the role of the gold digging wife. Lynn Keisha Thomas. Now, now, this is my boy right here. He went from ashy to classy. Playing the role of Jackson all the way from Saginaw, Michigan, Joseph Poole. Now, now, that's all right. Give it up for him. Playing the role of Sean. Stellar Award winner, Grammy nominated, born right here in Detroit, come from a family of singers, playing the role of Sean is Kiara Sheer. Hey, now, I got to give y'all the, the livest band in the world, our music director. This boy bad, he on the drums. Our music director, Corey Rogers. Come on, Corey. I've been knowing you since you was little, boy. You've been doing this. All right, all right, all right. Moving on. Go to the man that's on the keyboard. It's a family of them. It's a lot of them, too. But this one brother right here is a bad boy. Ryan Riley. He on the board. Come on, Ryan. Show him what you got, baby. Okay, okay. On the guitar. This brother, he ain't no joke. Tony Jefferson. Come on, Tony. Yes, sir. A broken covenant. Woo -wee! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Every church got what it is. As soon as you hear it, the pastors start clowning. When you hear it, the pastors start clowning. On the organ, we got none other than Demetrius Harrell. Come on, D. Yes, sir. Now we going to one of the baddest instruments. We going to the guy on the bass. He's a big fella and he know how to work that thing. Lamar Hall. Yes, sir. Come on, Lamar. I see you, boy. Okay. Moving on, moving on, moving on. She played first lady. She played the date with the Skittles. She's also the assistant director and the executive producer. Akina Long Benton. Look at her in her first lady hat. There she go with the Skittles. Yes, sir. Go ahead. Hey, I need everybody in the house to get on your feet. It's not often, it's not often when y'all can see God put a vision in a man. 
and he put it right in his head and then he put it out there for you to see it. Okay, get on your feet. Yes, this is God's visionary. Writer, director, and producer, Martel Taylor. Yes, yes, yes. First, I got to thank God because without God, none of this is possible. Absolutely none of this is possible. Then I want to give it up to my cast. I want to give it up to my cast. Thank you. I thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all, this does my heart good just looking out, seeing the room packed. Um, thank you for coming out and supporting. We got to... I always wanted to be an actor. That was a fake crap. Don't, don't, play, don't pay that no attention. Don't pay that no attention. <laughs> right. That's my allergies, like uh, Jackson said. But again, there's so many people behind the scenes. It takes a whole lot to put on a production like this. I cannot begin to name everybody. But I will say this. I have a group of family and friends that support me in everything I do in everything I do. So I want to thank you wherever all of you are at. I just want to thank you. You know who you are. I love you. I love each and every one of you for being there. And this is, not, this is only the beginning. We're trying to take this thing on the road, y'all. We're trying to take this thing on the road. So again, once again, I want to thank my cast. I want to thank my crew. I want to thank the lavish band in Michigan over there. You know what I'm saying? And y'all be looking for more from Taylor One Films. All right? Thank y'all so much. Drive safe. God bless you. And keep you. Have a safe ride home. We love all of you. Thank you for your support. A broken covenant. Yes. Be Rudd Pro.